Welcome to the third night of Giant Head and Dodgy Lighting. By the words, uh, Rob's uh, video log of renewal 2022, 25th anniversary. But I said that before, so let's move on. Okay, came out of today. A couple of key observations that have got to be made. Uh, first of all, I seem to see a lot more children playing and really, really getting into the lab. It just feels that there's been an explosion of, of youngsters. And their enthusiasm is awesome. Their desire to just get into what's going on is awesome. Their desire to rain hell on adults is awesome. This is kind of like Lord of the Flies, only in a good way. If a horde of children hammering an adult with swords is a good thing. Well, they were having fun, so yeah, it's a good thing. They were having an inordinate amount of fun, so that's a great thing. I'm not talking about the kids, I'm just talking generally around camp. And it's really great to see more and more youngsters uh, coming, coming to the game and having a great time. But that, that's my first observation, and it's fantastic. Um, uh, second one is this, this particular event seems to be uh, a little above average on its lethality and some of the consequences you can have on, on player thinking. It's possible in this particular in this event for players to have an, to gain an advantage in one part of the game by giving up their chance, part of their chance of surviving in a combat. That's a, that's a really interesting measure. I'm not sure long-term view of this, this particular this particular, this particular um, mechanism is going to be but it's new and it's bringing out some interesting results and yeah I like that I and mean, in fact it, I, there's been a whole load of conversations going on today about well is death in lap a good or a bad thing now personally the player or when I'm playing I should say because I'm I do mostly crew or do this now uh, I will have to say that I always love the games most without a high chance of my character dying. I like the adrenaline. I like the feeling that I had to work for the right to win. And I had to be clever or fast or just plain not stupid. Um, but whatever the reason, and I, I shouldn't say anything more than that because we don't really want to get into things that could be sort of, uh, sort of setting a, a bad standard or anything. But the chance of losing my character is something I really liked, and I still, still kind of, I still like it. It's, it brings an element of risk. You, you're not just going through some motions because you're the hero and you're going to win. You're a person involved in something big, and you're taking real chances of your life, and it just makes it more. Even in fantasy, makes it more real for me. But there's been a lot of conversations about this going on, and I think that's great. Uh, so it's really the big, big ones. It's the level of children I've seen is is awesome, and some of the new mechanisms are really interesting. There's another another new mechanism I'll just mention before I go, and that is there's been now change which is allowing players to be picked up and dropped in the right environment for for um, a situation. Shall we say? Okay, okay, a skirmish fight. So. People are now being dropped into battlefield circumstances for skirmishes rather than playing in the round at the camps and, uh, and the trail between the camps. It's really again leading to some really intense combat play. It'd be interesting to find out what the play, more of the players think about this. And it's a, <coughs> excuse me, but it's a change and it's an interesting one. So in this game, we're really seeing some mix-ups of, of, of mechanics. Uh, but everyone I'm speaking to seems to be having a good time. Uh, if you've got views on these, please pop them in the comments. I'd love to, I'd love to hear them. And I'm sure Steve would love to hear them too. So please put those in the comments. But until next time, from another dodgy location, this time I'm, I'm in my tent, uh, we will, um, I will say good night to you and or by the time you read this, whatever time it is good, whatever time of day it is you're watching this, and see you again soon. Bye-bye.